We are right in the center of Switzerland, very close to the town of Lucerne, and we have a lot of farmers in this region. And we deliver our milk products to the farmers. We bring in whey from all over Switzerland. We take the whey concentrate and by ultrafiltration, we separate whey protein and whey milk sugar. The whey protein goes 100% into the feeding of the cattle. We didn't know exactly what to do with the milk sugar years ago. So we decided five years ago to build a biogas plant and to use the milk sugar as energy. And the biogas we use then on microgas turbines to produce electric energy. The reason we have installed 12 CR65 is because of the exhaust gas temperature. The CR65 comes with an exhaust gas temperature of 305 degrees Celsius. This hot exhaust air is used for the direct production of steam. After the steam boiler, the exhaust gas still has a temperature of about 170 degrees Celsius. This warm air is used as an energy source for a drying process at the client's tower for drying its product. We even use the warm air for cooling the electronics, which we collect and bring it into the client's process. And by doing that, we have an overall efficiency of more than 90%, which is an excellent value for this kind of plant. The main point behind this idea was being able to produce cattle feed without using or producing CO2. We wouldn't have been able to do it if we wouldn't have built the biogas plant, if we wouldn't have chosen capstone turbines, a new steamer and hot air for the spray drying plant. That gives us the efficiency and that makes us the leader in producing cattle feed without CO2. This site is responsible for 1.7% of CO2 reduction of Switzerland, which is required under the Kyoto Protocol, which is tremendous. This is one of the major applications with a huge potential for the microturbine technology. We produce here green energy because we don't use oil for producing uh, steam or hot air. So, we get a better price for the electrical power we bring into the electrical system in Switzerland. The CO2 reduction is important to our clients because it should be important to everybody. This is not just here, but I think the difference is that this client takes this seriously and is doing about something about it and not just talking about it. Today we are glad and happy the plant is running and we are producing the energy we thought it would produce.